Can do me a favor. <laughs> With your hand, show me how you eat the palm. <laughs> do you just, or do you, do you massage the palm? The power is not me being in everywhere. Mm. The power is me being able to multiply other people yeah. who want to tell stories about culture and that having significance and value and 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 helping someone's livelihood also. You I'm look, good. You look amazing. You ah. look amazing. Thanks, Kibarki Metako Alexander. Good to see. I just want to be able to create the mood for women like me, um, anyone like me actually, it's not particularly to women, but anyone that's like me, yeah. feels like I feel, likes the things I like, goes through the same things I go through. I want to be able to make music to help them explain where they're at. That's, that's so real. Yeah. Most people walk away from me feeling like super positive they're like oh yeah. you've got this like positivity kind of radiating out of you and i think it's because i'm just always myself yeah and i try and always be myself yeah and there's um interacting with somebody who doesn't deserve that then, yeah. <laughs> you, might as then, then you, you get then you, just a then war. You just, just a war <laughs> what's one meal you think michaeli would absolutely love eggs and kfc <laughs> eggs and kfc that's it first off but it's been a pleasure with you it's been yeah. stellar <laughs> You get, you get. You, get, you, 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 said, get you said it so many times yeah, that I'm you're now starting to anticipate what you're about to say. You know, you should say it like. I saw the smile. Yeah. You're like, I saw the cheek go. <laughs> so, no, yeah. no I, I don't know. Maybe in a little, just like a stroke. <laughs>going on guys it's your boy level and tatarumpid welcome back to seats with and today it's a takeover baby Woo! if you guys do not know still is having one of the most exclusive yes sir. one of the most highly attended yeah. and one of the most interesting dinners celebrating culture in south africa yeah this podcast is sponsored by stella guys we're gonna have a whole bunch of celebrities putting through today seated right next to level and tato rampedi yeah on your favorite podcast um, <laughs> Seated. <laughs> seated with. If you guys don't know, on TikTok, on Instagram, we are now at Seated With. We have a whole bunch of short form content going through. But it's interesting, man. Like, they're having a really amazing dinner. And to give you guys more context, they have this about once a year. Yeah. Where they invite the best of the best from fashion. It's very, very exclusive. Very exclusive. From music. Yeah. From food. Yeah. And a whole bunch of influencers and celebrities, which is basically the conglomerate. Yeah. And I'm so excited for you guys to see who's going to be seated mm -hmm. over here. But before we get started, question of the day. Question of the week how are you how are you how are you if you guys are watching this on youtube let us also know how are you in yeah, this yeah. and but let's get it started do you want to go first no no go for it hey. how am i okay how have you, cool. you been how have i been you know i am on another level yeah. i'm happy guys i'm so happy i'm nearly done of school <laughs> well i'm nearly done of this year of school <laughs> are you ever really done yeah. Yeah, yeah and keep in mind we are so proud of the podcast. I mean, for us to be at Stella is a huge yeah. thing. It's a huge thing. Shout out to you. So guys. maybe we are, you know. Yeah. And we're maybe gonna we are and doing we're, something. We're, we're gonna be going to go mingle because there's yeah. a dinner, there's we're gonna courses, go, you know, there's you know, music. Might even smell a glass of something. I don't know why. Yeah. People smell the wine. <laughs> <laughs> I even practice my rich laugh today. You're gonna hear it. Yeah, yeah. You're gonna hear it. Just say anything, just say anything. So the weather today is quite lovely. <laughs> <laughs> You, you. <laughs> you, you need to get it from the chest. Yeah, yeah. Take it seriously. Let me try. Let me try. You Give go me one. So, so, so then I said, <laughs> "There we go." Yeah, a little bit more. Uh. <laughs> 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 so, uh, yeah, but, uh, how are you? How are you doing? I'm good, bro. Ah, dogs. I've been watching a whole bunch of shows. You guys are gonna yeah. see it under the podcast. I'll show recommendations, but I've been taking it easy, bro. Mm -hmm. Pushing a lot of production on Rampiti Media side, which is a lot of fun. Yeah. And we've been getting a whole bunch of deals also, which is really like interesting. Yeah. yeah. You know, everything is still going strong. You know, apartment is almost fully finished, by the Ooh. way. So check out my IG. The apartment is looking very clean. Yeah. I'm bringing in touches of brown, yeah. touches of beiges, yeah. you know, touches of white. Pinterest board buffet. Pinterest board buffet to <laughs> get yours now. <laughs> Tata Rampiti is Pinterest board. <laughs> Too clean, but you guys keep watching the podcast. Today is going to be extremely 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 interesting of all the people that we have to interview and this is going to be a great one of yeah. your brother yeah my brother and i yeah my brother and i my before we now. get into the interviews i want to ask you a question bro Go ahead. when was your last fancy dinner date fancy dinner fancy date. where you were like yeah yeah can i have a bottle of yeah I, two two um, two glasses um uh, shout out to i don't know the restaurant i remember can i say the restaurant i think it's yeah, yeah, yeah of course I think it was at cream Say. my graduation dinner oh that yeah. Hey! Yeah. So, yeah, yeah. Sorry, guys, I've got bands. <laughs> you have battle scores, man. I've got battle scores from yeah. Groove. I don't want to show ish. I don't want to show them. But, uh, 
It was so like cream. Cream your graduation. Yeah, I had the cheapest. Two years ago. No? Yeah, I had the cheapest uh, meal there. Yeah, they didn't have. I don't know why. Because first uh, we looked at the menu, my friend and I. Then yeah. we said, "Do you guys have um, ice in a bowl, so we can eat ice in a bowl <laughs> and then have water?" But uh, they didn't have it, so we ended up. And then you go and say, "Can we just have a side of chips?" That's yeah. like the broke man's. Uh, hey guys, I'm, I'm, I'm here with you guys, man. I just, <laughs> I'm here, but not. I yet. wanted to come with you. Guys. I just ate. Yeah, I just ate. <laughs> ate. Oh, I'm not even thirsty. People are drinking in and stuff. <laughs> but it was very nice. Very nice. What about you? Crazy enough, also cream yeah. at. Um, there by four is more, man. What's that place? Monte Cassino. Uh, Monte Cassino. Monte Cassino. I went yeah, there yeah, with yeah. Camo like yeah. a month or two ago yeah. before she left. Bro, when, when I entered there, they were like, ah, I don't think I, felt, I, don't think I was it. dressed. Up, I don't think I was dressed apart. Yeah, were well, you just like this? Because you no, look no, amazing. No. Thank you. Thank yeah. you. I wasn't dressed like this. I think I was dressed like chill. I was wearing like a jean and like a normal t-shirt. Uh, then like then a then nice mind. sneaker. And then they were like, I was like, hey, can I get a table? They were like, for wow. I'm like for two. two. Like, oh, you want to? I was like, yo. That was my last time. I got there. I bought a nice bottle of wine. Yeah. Not to, for them. Just, just for the wine I was I drinking. Drink, I yeah. did my god. What's my last time, bro? Yeah. One thing I'm really scared of is dinner with my girlfriend's dad for the first time. Yeah. I remember, like, in my previous relationships, I used to be so scared of meeting like my girlfriend's parents. Yeah. But I feel like I've never had. I've never met a parent who didn't like me. And that's been my also, number one skill. I, I suspect that they like you in front of you. Ha. Huh. Yeah. Then and behind then my you, back, they when then. you leave, they go. Uh, uh, when you leave the room, they go. They go. Uh, uh, Jeez, that guy. Eh? I picture them in the room going, hey, did you, did you? <laughs> when he said, no. <laughs> now for me, they're like, yo, jeez, that guy. Hey, yo. <laughs> what, what do you get him? <laughs> uh, but how many, okay, let's let's like, give me the number of parents you've met. Me? Yeah, in your lifetime so far. <laughs> Guys, comment down the number of parents you've met. Let's go. Good, like, the number, like, does the same parents count as one? Yeah, No, no, no. One, mothered one, mother dead two. Okay. So, that's so two. I've met, I've met, I've met a mother. Yeah. I've met a father. Yeah. I've met another mother. Yeah. Then I've met a father. <laughs> yeah. Just says. Yeah. Okay. And that's that's three relationships because it's like yeah. first girlfriend. She's hey, hey, that, uh, just, they, hey. It wasn't explained more. <laughs> what about you? Yeah, let's just. Ah, uh, what? <laughs> <laughs> I just, I just remember how many parents you met. Yes. Yes. I know all the sisters that count oh, as parents also count. Oh, all the sisters count as parents? Yes, the ones okay, that okay, the parents. And I was trying to cheat. That's so you met, I can count. Yes, I've got one, two. That's it. And then, oh, three. So if you count the sister, three. Okay, what about parents? Ah! <laughs> four, five. <laughs> what about six, seven. <laughs> six, seven. <laughs> six, seven. <laughs> and Dave, I need you to blip out these names. <laughs> Why are you lying? I forgot about them. I forgot about them. Seven parents. I met seven that parents. That you can remember. I can remember. If you count the voice call or so, like a video call, I met a parent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Also, eight, so eight. So eight. Mm. Yeah, that's a lot, man. You're on a, you're on a record. That's a lot, man. It's crazy. <laughs> yeah. yeah. By the way, guys, we've got Rich and Aiden in the, in the background. And Dom. Stool. We've got Rich, Aiden, and Dom. And Dom, and Dom. Dom so, and yeah. yeah. Crazy. <laughs> but anyways, we're going to enjoy this fine dining experience today. And, you know, maybe i eat something more than that costs more than dunked wings. Hey, 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 hey. I don't anyways. know. I think they're going to live different lives. Like, no, I, it's a, uh, what is it? A, a hake. A hake. Yeah. No, a, a I, don't have, I don't have. A, yeah, I have a snook. A snook. Yes, yeah, so like drinking a sh- on a. But yesterday I was having a Chauvin Blanc, Pete from Cape Town. <laughs> I really Who? enjoyed that, Pete. <laughs> <laughs> it's a wine called Pete. It's it's Piet. Piet. <laughs> yeah, but I give it to Pete. It's Pete. Pete. Oh yes. And it, it's a 2011. Oh. Yeah. Chauvin Blanc. Yeah. 2011. Yes. Wow. Uh, I saw the video, but it said 20, 2022. No, no. They got the number wrong. Oh, it's that's, be- the, that's the year they give it to you. <laughs> <laughs> but the year was manufactured. No, the menu is at the bag. It will be at the bag. Oh, yeah, at so the bag it says twenty eleven. Beach Chevron Blanc, highly recommend. Cape Town, Cape Town, <laughs> made in Cape Town. <laughs> made in Cape Town. <laughs> it was nice. I had maybe two bottles. Didn't I? Had a yeah. nap. Oh yes. <laughs> <laughs> Massively yes. Massively yes. Yeah. Oh jeez. So guys, we finally have our very first guest, and of course, our guest had to come. You know what style? She's absolutely amazing. We have Miss SA Top 30. <laughs> Tando had there, baby. So it's a pleasure for you to be here. If you guys yeah. don't know, we're having dinner. So we're going to have a munch later. Yeah. I wanted to ask you some questions about like, you know, the overall vibe you've, you've been experiencing. Yeah. First question, I don't know, who did you come with today? I came with my friend. Yeah, yeah. A data analyst. Oh, so yes. Like, oh, he's, oh he's, yes. He's a friend and you know the job description. <laughs> <laughs> so <laughs> this is like the complete opposite of what he does. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's yeah. like... She's like, what's happening? <laughs> <laughs> so, yes, yeah. I came with a friend of mine, Jabulo. Yeah. He's yeah. somewhere. Yeah, yeah. shout out to him. Shout, yeah. out. shout, shout out, out to him. Yeah, because we always say it's so important to go with someone close to you for a dinner, yeah. Yeah. especially when there's so many people. Because I know when I get uncomfortable, 
he's like the first person I bring yeah. to like a you know plus yeah, one. Yeah. So question to you: If you had to go to a dinner and you are nervous, you're meeting me or you're meeting someone you don't know for the first time, complete stranger, what would you say to them? Oh well. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'd probably say hi. I'm not a very, I'm not too awkward. But yeah. I'm actually not awkward at all. So I'd probably just say hi. I'm Tando, and then I'd let you. I'm Tado. <laughs> yeah. Then it finishes yeah, there. So I'm, I'm not too awkward. I'd probably just say hi and yeah. introduce myself. You know. That's cool. I get that. I'm gonna I'm gonna go into the deeper questions now. <laughs> We're going to go cultural now. You know, seven color Sundays. What's one thing you think should be actually left out? In a seven color dish. Yeah. Yo, what should be left out? Ah, the beetroot. Ah, the beetroot. It's, you know the, how many Limpopo homes the beetroot has been helping? It's the whole dish. <laughs> yeah, the beetroot. I like it's it. Content- it even it even even colors the plate ah. a different color and then the ah, fingers let's and let it go, guys. you don't let like let the beetroots. It's ah. not that I don't like. It just contaminates everything. Then everything is red. Like <laughs> the meat is red, the rice is red, mm, the mm. cabbage is red. Mm. Yeah, no. Let's, 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 let's so, get so, so do you mix your food together or do you eat it individually? Yeah, that's another. Good Are you big, a mixer or you a piece by so, piece? <laughs> so if I'm having like pap and pap and cabbage or pap and egg. Wait, wait, wait! I, I want I, before before together. you continue, ne? Can you do me a favor? <laughs> With your hand, show me how you eat the pap. <laughs> do you just, or do you, do you massage the pap? Do you I, massage I, it, or? I'm going to try and be a lady. I'm yeah, do this. okay. Yeah, okay, I can do this. <laughs> <laughs> Is it uh, easy? No, I, I'm a, I try to be a lady, man. I'm a sous. Yeah. No, it's too clean. It's too That's clean. amazing, amazing. So don't forget, guys, we've got a whole bunch of guests we're interviewing, but the first hashtag you guys should be using is let's do dinner, and the second one is a festive get-together. Hashtag let's do dinner with JR. That's a show that we should do. Yeah. I think that'll sound amazing. JR, how are you? So you're going to say that to everyone. No, no, it's the first time. It's the first time. How, yeah, how are you doing? It's a lot doing? of the same things. Like, okay. <laughs> we're trying to impress. We came here yeah. with lines before we came. Like, oh, okay, if we okay. say JR, compliment the outfit, yeah, no, and then we'll get come up with nice. the show. Yeah. You yeah. look amazing, by the way. <laughs> Oh, one you step go, one. You know, another one. You want to hear that one? GQ. It says GQ. Yeah, it says GQ. 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 <laughs> <laughs> no thanks man thanks guys yeah. 100% so everyone just walked in now we just started with the event with the dinner yeah. from from walking in what are you experiencing what, how are you feeling about everything I mean it looks fabulous I mean yeah. um, you guys can see for yourself and I'm, I'm, yeah. I'm pretty sure that you know everybody who's checking out the podcast whether they are going to be watching it whether listening to it you know they'll get a, a feel of the caliber of people who are here yeah. the decor mm. is also amazing 100%. Um, everything looks great you can see that Stella's ha- you put a lot of effort into yeah. the execution of the event, you know. Um, yeah. And I guess again, also it being an extension of an, of of what happened in the US, um, you have to you know put the scale there. Yeah. And it's it's really a global event, you know. It could be anywhere in the world, 100%. executed anywhere in the world, and it would still look amazing the way it mm. does right now. So kudos to them. Yeah, no, definitely yeah. world no, class. But, yeah, you're speaking about standard of the event, and you know we have to we are very playful on this podcast. We're going to give you a couple of standards with you. What when you having your perfect meal, right? What are you? Do you like to watch something? Are you listening to something in the back? Like, what's your go-to in terms of your favorite meals? I think with the favorite meal, like you know, the ambiance needs to be right. Yeah. And the ambiance is not made of one thing, right? Mm. Um, even the the noise of how loud you're chewing is very important. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes when so, I stand was, up, yeah, <laughs> you know, sometimes you stand up. You know what I'm saying? So, so people do different things, but I think the ambiance, just the collective, you know, of of great music. Mm, yeah. uh, Great company is is the most important one for me. Mm, um, that's so you know, true. If, if there's one thing you're gonna, a meal is something that you're gonna consume that's gonna go inside your body. Yeah. yeah, yeah. The one thing you wanna do is put something in your body with someone you enjoy talking to. Yeah. You know, the conversations. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know yeah, what I mean. So, so, so something needs to flow, and then yeah. I guess I guess that's it. You know, but everything is a combination of of different things. Yeah. From the the drink that you're gonna be having, the company, the music. You know, are you outside, inside? So mm. I, 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 I think music is a big factor for me. Yeah, but yeah. more than that, conversations and, and just having people to connect with is, is, is a plus. 100%. Uh, yeah. Last two questions. Who are you expecting to see tonight? Like, who, who are you Last expecting to questions. see? Uh, oh, you want some more? <laughs> we'd, love, we'd love to <laughs> give you more. Are you Karimbe? We're flirting with you. But who are you expecting to see tonight? I, I, I have no idea. Um, yeah. Because if I'm not home, I'm 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 in the office working. If yeah. I'm not in the office working, I'm home. Mm-hmm. So um, and I was telling someone earlier on that I'm, I hardly ever go out. 
mm. everyone I see is a surprise. Um, oh, okay. That's nice, know, though. Yeah, yeah, you know mm. what I mean? Like, I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm looking at you guys, and I'm like, yo, you know, who are these guys? Hopefully, it's the last time the you young says, blood, you know what I'm saying? Blood, the the young blood. Blood. That's what yeah. I'm saying. You know what I'm saying? Because yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm hardly ever out. But I think, for me, it's not about any specific people that are, I, I just think the ability to connect with different people because I'm hardly ever anywhere. Yeah. Yeah. It's going to be a great one. You know, whether I'm meeting you guys and chatting to you and yeah. getting to know Le Le Tato, you know, mm. and, and all of those things. I think that for me is the most important. The, the the connections I'll be making, you know, the people I'll be chatting to. Yeah, It's not a lot of events that you get to go at and the, the principal concept is to connect. connect. Yeah, You know, so so it's about, I, you know, I'm about to send my driver to go get the business cards because I forgot them at home. You know, yeah, I'm yeah, going to be yeah. handing them out like, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you said something. You know what I'm saying? Handing them out like newspaper. Yo, I was about to say <laughs> something else. But, um, but, but I, I look forward to that, like connecting with different people. It doesn't yeah. matter who, not celebrities or whatever, just, just anyone. Bunch yeah. of people, man. I'm so surprised you say that, you know, like you keep to yourself and you're like, you know, you seem some like you seem like a person, you know, based off who you are and etc. Like that is huge on connection, etc. Just as you spoke now, you're speaking about connection and all those things. I want to know, family gathering now. Ne? What's your limit on the invites then? Because connection is for you saying it's amazing. Everyone can invite it. It's, yeah. it's for you, it's like a completely public thing, or do you have limitations on, you know, how many people you can invite? Ah, Jordan, I grew up in a place where yeah. everybody's invited. All streets, you know. Yeah, I mean I I grew up in Atridgeville in Pretoria. Yeah. Oh, Tapeli. Oh, yeah. You oh, know, nice. and and you know everything was for everyone. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Um, so I give it like you know to a place where I'm 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 building my own community yeah. and my own people. Everybody wants to be clicky, you know. Yeah. But I don't have a number, man. I just want people to enjoy, you yeah. know. That's my wife will have the number. She'll say, no, 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 no. Hey, you know, can I have anything more than I want? Sansa fell at that, you know. But now I'm like, ah, to come on, come all. Everybody yeah. needs to enjoy, you yeah. know. So I'm gonna limit, like, you know, yeah. But what are the limit? I'm gonna limit. You know, as long as it's B.O.B. If it's a B.O.B. <laughs> and you bring your own goods, you then know, everybody fine. can come. Yeah, but I mean, if I'm supplying, I know. Yeah, we now need to you're killing the numbers. Yeah. You know? <laughs> we need to have a, what is it called? Budget speech. Yeah, we need to have a budget speech. You know, we need to look at it and we need to be economical and then decide who's getting uh, what and who's yeah. getting what. You know yeah. what I mean? Because, yes. But yeah, otherwise, everyone's welcome. So yeah. I mean, for, and then from your side, anything new coming through? What can we expect from you? Oh, you know, I... So it depends when this is, you know. Yeah. Ah, this is coming out in a week or two. In a week or two. Yeah. All right, cool. So um, a lot of things. I mean, um, you know, in a week or two, it'll probably be the finale of Idols. Mm -hmm. um, and, you know, my record company, Feel Good CSR, is is, is doing the, the release of the artist. Mm -hmm. um, so so oh, we're amazing. excited about that. So there'll probably be new music out there um, mm, huge, huge, that's, that's huge, going huge, out. Huge. But also, yeah. I just think, like, you know, if it was back in the day when I was on stage and I was performing and doing all of these things, it would have yeah. been great. Be like yo, my my single is yeah. out. You know, <laughs> still huge. Out. Still I'll be massive. I'll be in it's was saying mm. you know, but I I think for now it's it's you know my, my work and my responsibility is to shine through other people. That's so beautiful. you know when if I was working with you guys, I'd be promoting you guys. You know, so so these artists, their music is coming out. It's gonna be something amazing to look mm. forward to. But myself, just keep grafting, just you know, keep keep happy and just keep pushing. Yeah, yeah and amazing. We love to actually once you guys drop one of your artists, we love to interview one of them maybe. You know, and yeah, ask them about, ask them about the experience with working with you yeah, and the label and everything. That'll be yeah, cool. Yeah, I think also, I mean, like, you know, these kids are on Idols, you know, yeah. which is, you know, still the biggest, you know, competition yeah. music reality show, you know, on the continent. Yeah. Yeah. And I think, um, you know, having guys like yourselves wanting to interview them is, is great. You know, mm. it's, it's very cultural. It's a finger to yeah. the pulse situation. And, you know, they need to speak to the market that you guys speak to. You know, yeah. they're young, they're they're in the space, you know, the music is young as well. It's not yeah. not old music. Love it so much. And we can't wait to see, you know, your light through your artists that you'll be managing, etc., through your record label, etc. But it's been a pleasure with you. It's been yeah. stellar. Did you get did you get uh, did you, did you, you said, said it so many times yeah, yeah. that you're now starting to anticipate what you're about to say. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you should say it like a I saw the smart, yeah. You're like, I saw that she go. <laughs> so, no, yeah. no I, I don't know. Maybe in a little stroke. Guys, our next guest is a personal favor of mine. Someone that I've been seeing in the industry doing a lot of culture, bringing together. If you guys don't know, I believe in bringing culture together as well. So, watching this man over here has inspired me to do that. And today we're here with Stella, and Stella's doing exactly that, yeah. bringing some of the most amazing people in South Africa together to celebrate the brand, just to celebrate, to bring culture together. So, just to you know, be, just to ask you the first question. I wanted to ask you, how do you feel about being around so many people that have in, that have influenced so much in the 
in the space. The space being South Africa, because we've got people from fashion, music, you know, food. I'm just grateful, you know what I mean? Mm. Um, I'm just grateful that, uh, that um, I'm just grateful that I have a place. You know what I mean? Yeah. Um, that's always important. I'm grateful that I have a place, and um, and I'm grateful that I could learn um, from from the space at all time. That's yeah. that's my mo. Just, yeah. just to be grateful, you have a place. Yeah. You know, um, even though you fight to be in the place or you work hard to be in the place, but like I'm, I'm also grateful that the work pays back because you become in the space. You yeah. know what I mean? Quick question from my side, like. What made you someone that brings the culture together so much? Because we've seen you like give so many young people opportunities. You've created so many different shows on YouTube, off of YouTube. Like, what made you start doing that? I'm just comfortable with myself that um, I'm not uh, I'm not intimidated or worried about um, giving somebody else like um, um, they uh, they acknowledgement and telling someone else they special it's like knowing how to say you love a person you know what i mean yeah. um i'm comfortable with myself to to um to submit myself to to greatness because greatness has no age yeah you know yeah, and, and a lot of young people are doing great things and i'm comfortable with submitting myself to to that energy um, oh, okay. you know if I can ask, like, I was I was say, I'm the serious questions. He's the, <laughs> yeah. he's the fun I'm very playful of my jokes and <laughs> yeah, stuff. Yeah, but yeah. I want to ask, like, you know, you keep in touch with a lot of the youth, have an impact on the youth, like, on a high level, you know? And I want to know, like, how do you keep up with all the trends and all the fashion lines? Like, is yeah. there a team behind you? Is it like you? Is I, it like... I definitely have a team behind yeah. you. You know, the, the beauty about this thing is that it started with only me. Yeah. But um, my dream was that if I could make this I, thing I do, give a job to somebody else yeah. so they could actually say i do this because when i was doing they're like what are you doing yeah but i got like people waking up saying they're going to work yeah. like getting salaries because yeah. of this thing that um that like um that literally wasn't like what are you doing writing talking and interviewing artists blah blah <laughs> yeah, you know what you i mean yeah, so um yeah. so for me the power is not me being in everywhere mm. the power is me being able to multiply other people yeah. who want to tell stories about culture and that having significance and value and 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 helping someone's livelihood also you know, okay. you being one of the architects of culture you know like we're very playful on this podcast. We're gonna have, I'm, a bit, I'm still, like, still waiting for the play. <laughs> 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 you keep on for the play. This play thing. I'm so, still waiting for the so play. I want to know, Nam, yeah. you're cooking, Nam. Yeah. It's Sunday night, you know? What's that one song in the background? I want to see you. I want to <laughs> feel it. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh, hey. I, my, my, my taste is too wide. Yeah. So I'll tell you what I'm playing with right now. Maybe yeah, no, I'll give, give us something. I mean, yeah. I'll, t- I'll tell you what I'm, what I'm really missing with right now. I went back like two weeks ago. And I started like listening to the Eilie Brothers, you know. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. I even know the Eilie Brothers. Uh, that's, that's from the nineties. <laughs> where's, where's how way back is that one? The Eilie Brothers have been singing since the seventies. Hey, oh, okay. And <laughs> I heard it in the nineties. And, and they just <laughs> dropped the song because it's, really? it's like brothers, and yeah. they just dropped the song yeah. right like last an album last year with Beyonce on the yeah. feature. Oh wow! You know, so they've literally been like making hit songs from. 19 i mean you know alias at your best you are yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. at your best they wrote that's their song oh you know what i mean yeah, yeah. half of the samples that you guys hear half of the music that you guys hear Derived it's from. literally like stuff that they've sampled everybody has sampled those guys oh. so i'm messing with that i play a lot of jazz you know and then i love the hip-hop like when new hip-hop comes out you know i mean yeah. i mean one the album that i think is so perfectly made right now is nasty c's album okay. you know yeah. It's like you know. I don't even it's hear. Very balanced. I don't even need to hear what he's saying. Yeah. It's just, it just feels good. <laughs> okay. You know when albums feel good. Yeah. 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 Where you, don't, yeah, yeah, yeah. Where, where you can play it in the background and not don't care what's what happening. It is. You yeah. know what I mean? That's that's speaking, one. Album. Speaking of music, I get it again. Uh, you're making the a playlist for the love of your life. How many songs are we adding? Give us any number. Man, it's infinite, man. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> it's okay, infinite, right. man. <laughs> Yo, uh, like for real, like um, um, music. You know, I always tell people that sometimes people hate life and they forget that there is music. Mm. Yeah. You know, Damn, yeah. music is uh, music gives us 
everything from love there's so many different songs for love because i could create a playlist for somebody that i love and i could have a romantic song i could have a song where we're traveling i could have a song where we're having fun at the club because you know our life is not around just like our life is around like the holistic thing right so the playlist could be mad crazy you know what i mean that's nice no, but we, we thank you so much for coming onto the podcast. It's been great to hear your sign and your impact on the youth, music, and yeah. all of the above. It's been amazing. Yeah. 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 I hope you enjoy the dining experience that you're about to receive that side. Oh, yeah, I'm, I hope I'm they feed you guys. Uh, yeah, yeah we, are, we, are, we are hungry. Also. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, she's like, I hope they have pop. Something. I hope they're not feeding you guys because you guys need to be podcasting. <laughs> <laughs> if I see you guys around the table, you're not doing your job. Yeah, you're yeah. not hungry enough. You're not doing your job. You know what I mean? Now we're <laughs> pushing the side. <laughs> Shout out, Jim. No, Shout thank out you. To you. Blessings. I'm here with our fruit man, baby. Hey, wanna get something? Hey, wanna get something? Something, and there's something inside. How are you? I'm good, man. I'm good. I'm you good. Look, you look amazing. You ah. look amazing. Thanks, keep working, mate. Thank you, Alexander. Good to see you. Yeah. Now it's about it's Ellen Popo, so she you know how it goes. Yeah, no, no, no. Mr. Alexander uh, uh, keeps the skin glowing. No, but no, yeah. no, no. But we are here at the Stella event, and yeah. you know all good things about dining. Um, yeah. Definitely have to ask you. It's a it's a bit of a funny one, mm-hmm. you know. Seven colors. Yeah. What's one thing you would remove? Uh, one color. <laughs> <laughs> Which one? Give me a food. Uh, I don't like beetroot. I, uh, I, love I don't beetroot. like beetroot actually. Oh my god! Here we go. Uh, I love the color, but yeah, I, we could do without the beetroot. Beetroot nali bu a finger painting. No, beetroot ina lu seinya ita ulite di loko plating. Wawa, ding ding it drops on your shirt. Now it's a problem. It's yeah. worse than red wine. But um, yeah, I would I would remove um, beetroot because of that. Yeah. But beetroot is also nice. Um, yeah, it's hard to you can't mess with seven colors. Man. Yeah. yeah. It's original. Yeah. Nali bu khut na. White it. White it. But yeah, khut definitely have to ask you as well, man. Yeah. Kiss Sunday. Sure. You with the love of your life. You know, what is one thing you're gonna cook for her? Uh, my wife loves uh, seafood, yeah. so anything seafood, shellfish, uh, you name them: yeah. oysters, mussels, yeah. prawns, yeah. crayfish, salmon, uh, anything that is seafood. Um, that's what I would, you know, go for. Uh, um, you're really not shellfish. No, uh, you get. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you're not selfish. Shellfish. No, 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 no. I'm not selfish, <laughs> but uh, we do shellfish. <laughs> yeah, I love selling fish. Yeah. <laughs> Funny enough, I grew up selling fish. Yeah? Really? Fried fish, yeah. What? What? Yeah, I, I learned cooking. Um, get some kuinya go dalling after my kuinya paisa fish. So it's a uh, battered fish, uh, with a little bit of a uh, um onion, beans, and 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 vinegar relish on the side. Do you also believe in that thing of covering the fish with the newspaper to enhance the taste? Or? Uh, it does not enhance the taste, <laughs> but it gives you that experience. So, uh, we buy like a takeaway that you can have, you know, while walking. Yeah. And, you know what I'm saying? Uh, but they use better ones now, wax printed uh, with with a with a um, a newspaper print on it. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, because the ink gets onto the food, food. and and yeah. yeah. No, but it's been a pleasure with you, Kurt, man. This has been amazing. You look great. Hope you have a great time. Oh, die in a way. Ah, no, thank you. You know much. Such a good file. No, don't carry compliments. Thank our confidence in your anarchy. So, love one. No, definitely. Yeah. I'm, I'm coming. Let's go, actually. Let's say, let's walk now. Yeah, I'm Tato, keep the podcast. <laughs> What's up, guys? We are back. And, yo, we've been having such a great time it's been at amazing. this event. It's been literally the festive get together. And, like, we've been dining hard. Like, yeah. Hard, hard. I, I, I even ate something I can't pronounce. <laughs> They were saying that the slow rib was was slow cooked for eight hours. Eight hours, After guys. Those eight hours, it was furthermore slow cooked. But guys, for a longer period of time. It makes so much sense. Like the whole reason that everything is happening is because Stella believes in a certain level of connection. Yeah. They want to believe that anyone and any person can connect over the right type of meal and the right type of conversation. Yeah. And that is truly evident today. But. You guys know what time it is. We're going to go back to the usual program of Tata and I. Yeah, Maybe yeah. play one game, two games, and go back to interviewing people. Yeah. Yeah. But before we do that, how have you been enjoying the event? It's been good, bro. I like the one thing one of the hosts said. They were saying that, like, yo, COVID brought so many of us, like, away from each other. Yeah. We put ourselves in our own cocoon. And ever since that, it's been so hard for people to go back into socializing. Mm. So the purpose of this is for them to bring back people into socializing, bring back people into connecting with each other, bring back people into sharing a good drink, yeah. having a good meal. And what better way to not do it than being with the best people in South Africa? Yeah. 100%. But that brings me to our favorite type of game. Today's game is, what did COVID take away from you? (laughs) But before we start that, 
Guys, if you're listening to this on any streaming platforms, make sure to make, give us five stars. Yeah. If you're watching this on YouTube, screenshot your favorite parts with the favorite interviews, tag yeah. us, tag them, and make sure that you share it on your Instagram profile or any place at all. I'm going to say this so fast, man, and I want you to judge me. Yeah. I'm going to say it super, super fast. Go ahead. Relationship. What's one thing that you are? So that COVID took from me. Yeah, that COVID took me. Relationship. Your what? Relationship. 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 Your relationship. <laughs> relationship. <laughs> Dude, COVID, like, I, re- I know when COVID started, man, I saw my first friend. Yeah. Let's say their name, Lucas, boo. <laughs> Gone. After <laughs> my seven working days, my daddy, boo. How many, how many COVID relationships are left? Let's just have a... That's a, a good um, question. Guys, uh, let's just make sure. Studio, let's check. Hey there. Yeah, we, anyone in the COVID? We, Zero. Rich. Do we? Lost. Do we? Next level. Next. Oh no, mine. Uh, yeah? You know, uh, man. man yes, uh, made the rest in the uh, podcast. <laughs> um, <laughs> yeah, what's one thing to uh, go took from you? My sense of smell. And no one believes me. You can't. Smell I haven't anything. smelled in like since COVID. That's I had COVID good, twice. Bro. How, I had do you, COVID how do you twice. know how you sm- like so cologne? How do you know how you smell? I don't know. I just spray. I have to like really be close to the smell, like to Yo. be able to smell. But I can't smell far. That means you must get someone to just be like. You must be like, baby. Well, I must go to the ear, nose, and uh, uh, throat, ear, chest. Yeah. Ear, nose, Come and chest. Ch- what? Stay with me. It's ear, nose, and what? The for real throat. Yeah, ENT. Hey, man, it's not chest. It's ear, nose, and throat. It's chest. Oh. E-N-T. I'm just joking, guys. Uh-uh. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't see what you said. We won't forget. Okay, the, the, but okay, our next game, we've been asking this to a lot of people. Yeah. And I think that it's the perfect game. Who's the side chick? And when we say this, is in, <laughs> in every favorite plate. Who do you think is the side chick? I'm going to give you your first plate. You ready? Yeah. You have a plate of pa, spinach, yes. pumpkin, chicken, and gravy. I Who's like, the side I chick? I feel like a side chick is something that's sweet. <laughs> that's there, but not there. It complements the plate. So the pumpkin is the side chick. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it can, it can enhance or disrupt. <laughs> yeah. You know me, I'm never going to cheat on pop, guys. I never, bro. Pop is pop the is home. A, pop is a forever. Pop, you can eat it alone. With milk, <laughs> butter. Yeah. Aromat. Yeah, aromat. KFC can, spice. Like anything. KFC my, mash and gravy. I think I'm going to say for this plate, um, I'm definitely going to go with the spinach. I'm gonna finish. Spinach, yeah. It's good for me. I should leave pop for for her, but like, the spinach just, makes me strong. Just, it just makes me strong. <laughs> <laughs> but I have to let her go. You ready for the next plate? Yeah. It is simple. In three, two, one. Okay. It is pasta. Yes. Mint. Yes. No. And I'm gonna throw in a drink now. Okay. Coke. The drink is Coke. Oh, like let's say the drink is like a soda. You never have pasta and like a drink. Okay. Like pasta, you like spaghetti, too much spaghetti. So who's the side chick? Nah, bro, that's a full-time committed relationship. That's a... That's a dual income that's household. A, that's, a, that's a, I love all of them equally. It's <laughs> <laughs> a dual income household. Because if you remove the spaghetti, you're eating, but I could do mince alone. Yeah. You could never do spaghetti alone. Yeah. I'd rather get noodles. Yeah. So definitely the side chick has to be the, the soda. The soda. Yeah. Definitely the soda. What about you? Uh, I'm definitely gonna go with the soda as well. Yeah, yeah. I can live without, live okay. without. I actually don't have one. I uh, know it's okay, <laughs> it's okay. But one of the topics that since we've been having such fine dining the, experience yeah. today with Stella, it's and it made me thought of uh, made me think. Sorry, yeah. I'm like, hey, yeah, yeah, man. <laughs> hey, sound. Did you catch that? <laughs> it made me want. It made you do what? It made me thought of. It made me think of. I mean, the connections I've made over the past <laughs> couple of years. Hey, hey guys, hey guys, um, uh, Davis Muna. <laughs> they make sure Muna. <laughs> cut that thing. <laughs> but it made me think of the connections I have made throughout my lifetime and and how meaningful they obviously have been. But tell me maybe about like what's your oldest connection you've had with someone? The and oldest I, connection that I can think of. Can I can I go first? Yeah, for sure. I think the oldest connection I've I can think of, and I think a lot of people are gonna relate to me with this one, is probably my mother. Um Literally, first cool. person I ever connected with, if I really deep it. But I also feel like... Hey, now you have to copy my answer. <laughs> no, my mom's not the first person I connected with. Really? I feel Outside like mom, family. my mom is probably the first person I ever bonded with, for real. Like, bonded with, for real, since I was a kid. Yeah, maybe you and mama, like, equally. Because, like, say, I've known you for a couple of years. You've known me your whole life. What? You've known me your whole life. I've known you for a couple of years. Your whole life. Yeah, which is a couple of years. <laughs> oh, but in your perspective, it's your whole life. It's all of your years. That must be so weird, like having a younger sibling and like, they've known you their whole lives, but you've known them for like a while. 
But honestly, to be fair, I just lived for two years without you, and it was just one and two. Yeah. And I don't, I don't remember life without you. You yeah. sound like you're hand. What did you say? I don't remember life without you. You sound like my what? Like a hand. Oh, okay. Yeah. yeah. I want to say, bro, I've been seeing you pose a lot of questions to the people that we've been interviewing. Yeah. You know? You've been talking about like a dinner which you make for your girl. Yeah. Now I'm saying you are also Sunday, you're with your girl, you're dancing, you're in a gown, in the, under the gown is a jockey. There's no keeper. Yeah. Who's that? Who do we play when we're on Can Sunday? we talk for a minute? And then you're like, yeah, I just baby, I'm hungry. Mm-hmm. Like, yeah, what do you want to eat? Mm-hmm. I don't know, you decide. What are you deciding? We, uh, I'm going to look and at it. And you can't say, mix spaghetti and minced meat? Oh, chef, don't worry, I'm not making anything. I'm going to say, baby, I'm gonna get you the ten dunk twings. She gonna say what? I said the ten dunk twings, <laughs> the ones that you sub aware on your status last night. <laughs> the ten dunk I'm gonna twings. get you the ten dunk twings. <laughs> she says what? And I'm gonna get you a dessert. <laughs> <laughs> what about you? I feel like my answer is always so cold. You compare to yours. Okay, no, but my real answer is. My go-to cooking meal and like it's such a man thing to do is a spaghetti bolognese. I like to do a, a spicy uh, spaghetti bolognese. Oh, nice, yeah. I love it. And then I always um, complement it. It's very zesty, your one. Zesty yeah. like in the tomato. Yes, yeah, like yeah, yeah. Um, and then I also just like as a complement of drink, I like a Chauvin Blanc, uh, two uh-huh. oceans, uh, Chauvin Blanc, mm. two oceans, or oh, I yes. would like a Stella, yeah. <laughs> you got this one. <laughs> I was going to ask you, what's one drink that will complement any meal? Stella. Stella. <laughs> now, for one thing, I feel like one thing I love with any drink, it definitely has to be like nothing. I actually read a video. I watched the video recently. You read a video? I watched the video recently. Oh, so when it's hard, no one says anything. It's because he pays the bills around here, guys. <laughs> hey, then. React, <laughs> Muna. <laughs> I watched the video, man. Yeah. They were like, you really should not have any liquids with your food. Yeah. Because when you get um, a meal into your body, all of the acids in your stomach are very healthy and there. Yeah. When the food comes in, psh, acid is working in. And when you put water or cold drink, it affects that, which is why you can feel fuller for longer yeah. when you've eaten um, and drank a meal all together. Because the liquid has to first leave your, your stomach before the food gets digested fully. Oh, and I actually okay. tested it out like, it's actually really like you, I, digest, I digest food so much better because I don't have it to drink. Yeah. That's, no, that's a healthy fact. Um, you guys let us know some food combos that we want to pose a question to you guys. It's your yeah. game purely for you. We're not going to be answering this one. What are some food combos that you are ashamed of? Comment down in the YouTube yeah. section, guys. I really want to know. There's been, I'll name one just for the sake of conversation. Uh, I used to, when I was very, very young, I used to put, uh, I used to make gherkin and, um, gherkin yeah. and custard. Speak up. Ah, yeah. I used to be like, I know, I know. Wait, I, I don't do it anymore. I know, I know. Don't judge me. Don't judge sweet me. Sweet and sour. Yeah, sweet and sour. Just like you. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. But Tato, um, we've been interviewing a lot of people today. Um, you have to tell me who's your favorite. Let's interview today. Yeah, I won't lie. So we we have someone coming. Hopefully, they didn't get to do the interview. Yeah. Uh, one of my boys, Lasizwe and and Mikali. So yeah. we are gonna have them later on the podcast. They just came when we had like a technical error. Yeah. But when they come back, I think it's gonna be quite a cool conversation. Yeah. Someone that we relate to. They're both influencers that have broken into traditional media, which we both have in our like respective ways. So. I'm really excited to interview them and just to see what their ideal meal is, yeah. just to see how they feel about the culture coming together yeah. and just also have a conversation with them. Yeah. yeah. Definitely can't wait to connect to them as well. I, I really loved the uh, Benny um, interview. I, I, was, I was, me because I wasn't there. I was perfect. I felt like in my element, nothing was holding me back. Like, I was just, oh. <laughs> I'm just joking. Hey, Zoom night. in the hand, hold. <laughs> but yeah, guys. Um, we'll be back soon with more interviews for just for you at the Stella event. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> so Shakana, we just saw you perform. We were this time. We were hearing you. It was absolutely amazing. Mm, we were like, you. wow, this is this is nice. And we're thinking, you know, when you with your loved ones, what type of food are you making? Yeah, that's a question in our head. Oh, I'm making everyone Mexican, mm. whether they want it or not. Yeah. Nachos. <laughs> everyone that knows me knows I make the best nachos. Yeah. Um, and yeah, good can playlist. Can I ask which cheese to use? I need okay, to know. Okay, okay. I'm, I'm, I'm very it's big on this thing. So can I just explain to you? Yeah, go ahead. It's sour cream. Just yeah. wait. Okay. So I, f- I, fry, I fry onion, I fry okay. corn, I put sour cream, and then I put... Mozzarella. Oh, okay. That's nice You're not one. into mozzarella? I, I, I mess with mozzarella. For I, the, I put mozzarella. Yeah. Do you give lectos, me? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I put mozzarella. 
And then I have like a cheese sauce over the nachos. Yeah. I don't necessarily sprinkle cheese over the nachos. It's a cheese sauce. Yeah. Oh, okay. No, yeah. nice. Mm. Yeah. Hmm. And then we must go to Shakana's yeah. for Please, you guys are welcome. Mikasa is the casa. Mikasa is the casa. Oh, that's beautiful. Um, definitely want to speak about, obviously, your music, right? Want to know, like, where does this all come from? Like, where does this all derive? Like, you can hear, sometimes you can hear pain. Sometimes you can hear love. Sometimes I'm like, I can feel you. You can feel me. I don't know what happens. I press play. I press pause. I, I, do, you get what I'm, do, you get, do you get what I'm saying? Like, I just feel everything. Like, where does it derive? Like, what is your, I want to say, vision for your music overall? Yeah, that's a nice question. I use astrology all the yeah. time to, like, because astrology kind of predicts what yeah. you're going through on the day. Music is like that, you know. Yeah. There's a song for every different day, every different mood. And I think I just want to be able to create the mood for women like me. Um, anyone like me, actually. It's not particularly to women, but anyone that's like me, yeah. feels like I feel, likes the things I like, goes through the same things I go through. I want to be able to make music to help them explain where they're at. That's, that's so beautiful. real. We've been asking so many people this question, right? Sunday dinner, you with your loved one. You're playing the Bobby music in the background, playing the nice playlist. What are you making outside of the Mexican food? Like, what are you okay. making to kind of seduce your loved partner? Yeah, like seduce, your, that's, that's a heavy way. You must seduce <laughs> to show the love. To show the love. Um, <laughs> um, to show your acts of appreciation. Yeah, what, would yeah. I, what would I make? I'm vegetarian, so I would make a vegetarian meal. Okay. I would probably make... Um, I would probably make a lasagna. Ooh. Okay. Yeah. Veg lasagna. Um, and a nice little salad. I'm, I also make the best salads. Um, and then some bread. He better like to eat. <laughs> <laughs> 100 no, but it's been beautiful. And like, um, just want to say on behalf of everyone, like we've connected with your music today. It was oh, very you. beautiful experience. Got to listen from inside and outside here. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. I love that. <laughs> You know, I did a little dance, but uh, it's been a pleasure for you to be on our podcast. It's amazing. Thank you I'm so much. I'm honored. Thank you for having yeah. me. Lots of love. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Hello. How are you? <laughs> <laughs> wow. Tato, can you please just dance? Yeah, no, it's a pleasure to have you here today. So if you don't know, I'm Tato, this is Lev, when we are basically doing a podcast speaking about the experience today. Amazing. Still has brought amazing people together. They've been speaking about the fact that COVID held us back. Right, And they're trying to bring everyone back together. You know, show people that there's culture. Mm -hmm. And we know that, like, food is amazing with family and friends. That's it. And watching stuff online is also amazing with family and friends. Sure. Yeah. And we've been watching you. So I wanted to ask you, like, a quick, you know, just to ice break the ice. What's one show that you would watch on your first date with someone if they had to be with you somewhere? Something just, just like that. for you. you. can close your eyes if you want to. You don't have to. You're there. The love of your life is next to you. Netflix is open. <laughs> Show Max everything. We'll press up. Whatever play. is, what is, what is, what is open. What are you playing? What am I playing? Yeah. You, okay. Uh, even let's if you're do there, this. it's fine. You can even, even if you've been there. Even if we've okay, seen international. You. Yeah. I'll say love and basketball. Okay. okay. Good, good. You gotta good. love love and basketball. If you love, don't love, love it, basketball. like, come on. It's for the culture. 100%. Um, locally, Shaga Ilim, but sorry. Okay. It is what it is. No, no, no. Okay, it is okay, okay. It is what it is. Amazing, by the way. Amazing, <laughs> Thank by the way. You. Definitely, it's so nice to see you. Definitely, though. I feel like you've contributed to so many of our screens and, like, you've impacted so many lives in terms of just, you know, the craft that you've, you. you've done, etc., And it's poured into, you know, people experiencing you. What's one thing you think you leave with people? Do you understand? Man. That's um, a little tough one. Yeah. It is. <laughs> I'm not one What's who, like, mark? analyzes themselves. But yeah. I think most people walk away from me feeling, like, super positive. They're like, oh, yeah. you've got this, like, positivity kind of radiating out of you. And I think it's because I'm just always myself. Yeah. And I try and always be myself. Yeah. And this, um, interacting with somebody who doesn't deserve that. Then, yeah. <laughs> then you, minus then you get then you, just a then you just, <laughs> just a war. <laughs> Another one. You're deeply in love, now. Okay. You're there. It's Sunday, like we're saying, everything yeah. is nice. Seven colors. What are you making for the partner of your dreams? Easy yeah. peasy. Yeah. I am the cook. In my yeah, circle, yeah, yeah. circle yeah. of friends, right. and in my family, everybody knows I can whip it up in the kitchen. So they always come to my house whenever I land in South Africa. It's like, mm. are you cooking tonight? I'm like, I still am jet lagging. Relax <laughs> tomorrow. Um, I'm making, I'm making a whole trout fish. Okay. I'm stuffing it with my favorite things and my secret ingredients. I'm okay. making sure there's like ample, mm. like truffle seasoning as well. Mm. Nice green peppers, red peppers, yellow peppers, onions, oh, and I'm just wow. like, yeah. yeah and then I wrap it up in a foil, oh. and it stays put. Then I start my rice dish. 
I am famous for my mixing of rice dishes, yeah. making sure I throw in my lemongrass there, some yeah. coriander, Yay. nice spices from <laughs> Dublin. <laughs> I can see. No, 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 no. I don't play. I don't play. I don't play like that. I don't play like that. Then there's obviously a salad for my rabbits. Yeah. I want a salad. I'll make a salad, but I always make my own dressing. I don't buy dressing. Really? So I'll make my, yes, like yeah. olive oil. I'll put in some balsamic and then I'll squeeze some lemon Ooh. as well. And then I'll throw in more truffle seasoning here and there and a bit of honey. People don't mm. know this. And my salads always have like a bit of fruit in it. Then I'm doing... There's more. There's more. Oh. The person's not fooled by that time. <laughs> no, no, no. Continue, no, no, continue, continue, no, no let me continue, tell you. Continue, continue, continue. Then we're roasting baby potatoes. Yeah. We're making wow. sure we're throwing them into the microwave first to get them nice and mushy. Mm. Then we throw them into a tray yeah, yeah, and we yeah. put them into the oven. Whilst that's happening and the rice is coming together, yeah. then make sure with whoever's the prime master, Must. please take the trout, put it six minutes on each side. Nothing six more, nothing less. Strict instructions. Yes. Please, when, when they list time, six yeah. minutes. Hasn't it been six minutes? And then <laughs> you got to be on the timer. And yeah. then it's six minutes on the other side. Side, we take that out, we throw that down, yeah. and then obviously, you know, we are you know, South African people, we love a nice thing with some kick in it, so yeah. some samples with a bit of chili. Oh, yes, that's my meal. Wow, wow. sorry, did that, that, that sound like a lot? Answer. That was the best, that was the best, okay, answer. okay, it sounds but like a lot. It's been a complete experience. We are so happy to have had you on this podcast. Hey. Yeah. Yeah. Bless him. We're kind of blessed this year. Yeah. Man. No, 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 100%. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> Papa God. We see you. We see you. We see you. We hope that you enjoy your dining experience with Stella. And well, like, did you yo. guys have fun? Oh, yeah, too much. That was amazing. Too yeah, much. yeah, 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 yeah. Dope, dope, dope. Yeah. Yeah. But thank you so much. Yeah. Thank, thank you so you. much. Guys, we had to keep people that make sense for the last couple of questions. We've got me, Clyde, we've got Lassie's way. Guys, it's a pleasure to have you guys here today. How are you guys? Good, how are you? Oh, I'm good. good, I'm good. How's the, how's the still experience been? Because you guys have been eating, I see it's like a three course meal. They said they've been making the oxtail or something yeah. for eight hours. How's the food? How's the, how's the vibe? It's been stellar. The food has been <laughs> great. Yeah. No, the food was really good. I love the whole experience. I feel like everything was very well thought out. Yeah. So, yeah, I enjoyed myself. Um, I loved the whole experience, the entertainment, yes. how everything was curated. It was very, very stellar. <laughs> that Shekana yeah. was amazing. Yeah. I love the performance. Yo, she's so yeah, talented. She's good, man. Yeah. She has her close friends, man. Yeah. Yes. I'm gonna ask you guys. I'm gonna start with you. What's one meal you think Mikhaili would absolutely love? Eggs and KFC. <laughs> eggs and KFC. Yeah. That's it. Facts. First off, are the eggs sunny? Are they are they hard? Are they boiled? They are boiled. Yeah. Gazana boiled. <laughs> and then what's one meal that Caesar would love? Lassiso doesn't eat. Let's just start there. Yeah. <laughs> you don't eat. Lassiso. But what is one meal you love? Tell me. Lassiso loves a home cooked meal. Let me tell you yes. something. Yeah. He loves a home cooked meal. He loves a good stew with rice. There was okay. a time where we actually went out for dinner. I thought we were going out for dinner. We ordered one cocktail, one co cocktail. And he's like, actually, Sisentini cooked. Let's go. <laughs> I'm like, but we're here for dinner. He's yeah. like, uh -huh, uh -huh, I want a home cooked meal. Mm, something nice. That makes sense. Uh, okay. Yeah. And Stella's been saying that, like, you know, the past couple of years have been tough because of COVID and mm -hmm. people have been apart and they're trying to bring people together. Mm -hmm. So we've been seeing you guys on social media and traditional media doing amazing things. Mm -hmm. How do you guys feel when you guys bring people together to just consume your guys' content? Well, that's a good question. That is a very good question. I think it's just organic and natural just to kind of connect with people on the internet and yeah. literally feel the love because during the time of the pandemic, everyone was just so concerned about their lives mm. yes. and the fact that in the moment that they're consuming our content, you could escape your reality of just, mm. Yo, this is awful, this is awful <laughs> you know? Yeah. Um, that for me means something which like we could connect with you one mm. way or another. Yes. 100%. And also just to add to what Lassizwe said, I feel like the nature of our job is to bring people together because we put out um, content for an audience that can relate to us and they mm. share a common interest of enjoying Lassizwe and Michali. So 100%. It's, it truly is a blessing and especially to meet and interact with those people outside of the digital space, yeah. it makes it more fulfilling to do what we do. That's nice. Have you guys been interacting with people today, like new faces? or We have. We have. Because I heard them saying you guys are always together. The MC was saying you guys are always side by side. Well, you know. We are. <laughs> we are. <laughs> we try to keep to ourselves, That's you know. Nice. So, yeah. What are you guys doing? I've seen you have an amazing show. I think you're on Thank like you. episode 6, 5 now, ne? on um, YouTube. Yes, I think I'm on um, six. episode, not 6, uh, 16. 16? Yeah. Of the same show? Or yeah. the new season? Yeah, though? okay dates, yeah. Oh, okay. So, 16 episodes of yeah. the same? Yeah. Started... It started two months ago. 
Damn. Yeah. I thought it was like, that's amazing. Okay, thank you. So how many do you have left? That's amazing. Um, I have a good 100,000. <laughs> Come in. Yeah. As many so dates as possible. It's many dates as possible, yeah. <laughs> and what have you been doing now, uh, lately? Michelle? So I've been traveling quite a lot for mm. work. Um, I'm trying to grow my digital footprint. Uh, so yeah, that's what I've been working on. And then also privately, some business ventures. Mm. So yeah, I'm just trying yeah, to... We've, we've been waiting for the makeup line. We've been waiting for the, mm. for the cosmetic line. I'm sure it's cooking. <laughs> but that's Save been amazing. your coins, ladies and gents. That's all I'm gonna say. <laughs> yeah, hundred percent. It's been amazing, guys. Let's see you me, Tali. Guys, that was absolutely amazing. What an amazing! I've got to meet such amazing people. Yeah. People who we've been seeing for the past couple of years, and it's so interesting to see them like come together and hear like what they're trying to gain from this experience. Like we're seeing that Jr. necessarily wants to, you know, be with the community, whether you're a celebrity or not. We're seeing Shikana's here for the vibes. It was we're seeing for the Mexican food. Yeah. We're seeing Tando's here for a good time. Like it was so nice meeting people from all types of you know south africa and people that are leading the south african culture you know yeah one thing about today we realize how the connections we've made with you guys have led us to the place that we are today yeah and we want to say as one pity brothers we are extremely grateful for the efforts that you guys have put into the podcast yeah it's more than enough for us to just make you smile but it's so much more for you guys to like the messages and everything yeah. so Huge, 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 huge yeah. shout out to you guys. So I think a question to you guys is whoever you guys enjoyed the most on the podcast today, yeah. comment down below, but go and tag them and be like, yo, we loved you on that episode. We need a full hour with you and the Rambetti brothers. We yeah. really appreciate that. Shout out to Stella for bringing us here today. Definitely going to be here next year, guys. Such a vibe. Yeah. And from me and my bro. Hey, thank you for grabbing your favorite seats of us and showing yourself some love today. Yeah, yeah. Ray Bans and Catamarans.